Welcome to the iRacing Rough Cup here at uh, Daytona. Um, I'm starting in ninth position, car number five, so I'm in a pretty low split here, which is a problem because uh, I'm expected by iRacing to finish fifth out of this lot. And I can tell you right now, right now, there's no hope for that. Setup. I am using a setup that was uh, supplied to me by James Nemeti. Uh, thank you very much for that. It's an excellent setup. A million miles from where I was going setup wise. Because um, I was doing it wrong. Green, green, green! Whoa! Wow, that had quite a bit of kick to it. Go left. Oh, there goes a couple. Right wow, side. there's You've cars all over the place. On the left. Go right. Clear. You end up out here leading. Third one. Go left. Oh right my side. God, it's Clear. carnage. Right side. Still there. Clear. Slow car ahead. Car stop on the right. Cars everywhere. Oh, right side. I'm letting people go if they want to go. Gosh. Still there. Hold your line. Are they giving me a 4x for that? That is really, really annoying. I was letting him go. Did I not give him enough room? Perhaps. Just trying to take it easy on this first lap. Let everyone have their moments. <laughs> There was plenty, wasn't there? God. Whoa. Run a bit wide there. Right. That's the reference for the lap. Look at those two so close. I can't believe what happened on the start, it just flicked right, it must be because it's on the banking, it's uh, I think he jump started, so uh, that's why he's going to have to go down in the pits there. 2 minute 11.67, you're in 5th. Everyone's missing the corner, including myself. Car number 3 and 4 here just seem to both need the same bit of space. Obviously, car number four coming um, coming off much worse. Things didn't go much better for car number ten, just losing it under braking and hitting the inside of the pit wall. Not wanting to miss out on the action. Number eleven loses it under acceleration. Exit stage right. And to round off the actions on lap one, car number thirteen, unlucky for some, under acceleration, had a little slow spin to the right to let everybody buy. My turn this time. Um, the black car comes past me and I'm sure he was had to turn in at some stage and when I made the turn in he was still there. So yep that was my fault. Um, didn't think it at the time but I'll take that. Oh, slow down for that corner. So I'm in fifth at the moment, which is astonishing. It won't last when people settle down; they'll their pace will tell. I think I'm still in survival mode at the moment. <laughs> Just let some of the hotheads. 
crash out and we'll see what happens after that. Should have changed gear slightly earlier then I uh, did hit the limiter. Um, people have mentioned that I'm hitting the limiter too much. Um, in practice I found that if I was short shifting I was losing all the time so the occasional time I hit the limiter I think on average I'm gaining. I know there is a program I can get to to, to beep at me when I should have changed gear but... One minute, Oh, not everyone's quite managing the corner still. Exit there. This black car behind me, I think, is faster than me. Especially in the draft here, I think he'll be looking to come by. You passed me well, Paul. Oh no! Whoa! Oh no, no! I just need to finish one of these. They say you cut yeah, the corner. Too, You'll have to slow down and give up the time gained. Whoa. You're in the middle. Three wide. Clear on the left. So we'll begin with card number 17 losing it at the chicane and uh, taking my attention away. Having said that, it is quite possible that I uh, wasn't going to make that chicane anyway. Got the slow down penalty and then... Uh, and then got swamped by two cars. Um, I just held my line, and uh, luckily they were both good enough to get around me without uh, without causing any further incident. Considering that didn't work out too badly, <laughs> I lost one spot. Even though, even though I got overtaken by two people, but one guy crashed out. I misjudged my braking for that chicane. And then I spotted that he'd done an even worse job of doing so. So I didn't bother going for the corner, cut the corner, got a slow down penalty, and then got overtaken either side, which was a bit scary. So I tried using auto blip as advised by somebody, um, sorry not using auto blip, using manual clutch. It didn't go very well, I need to practice that more before I end up racing it. Oh, I've done it again. They say you cut the course, you'll have to slow down and give up the time gained. I'm going to have to be careful of that. We've got a long way to go, and I'm already up to six incident points. 
We'll say right now we're going to lose safety rating and we're going to lose I rating in this race. I have struggled quite a bit with it, <laughs> with this track. One minute, 54.7, one, one, car stopped on the right. Whoa. Right side, clear on the right. Thought he was going to come right across there. So car number 13 just uh, lost it coming into turn one. Um, done that about a thousand times in practice, so... Um, but as he got going, I thought I was going to just nip down the inside, but uh, he kept going, so I had to back out of that. Oh, broke an hour too early there. Right, aim of this lap is to make the chicane. And now I've got a little bit of front right damage from that first lap touch. Maybe that's reducing the downforce a bit, so we're going to break ridiculously early this time make the corner and we'll build on that from there still got like nine laps to go or something like that the time to race 25 minutes I think there'll be about 14 laps in it depending on whether I get lapped or not Minute 53.7 Sometimes I drop a second for that corner, I don't know which whether I should or not. Same with this one, sometimes second. Right, let's make the chicane again. before the two down to third I could have gone a bit wider around that section to get a better exit it's fine though guys in front are definitely faster than me so no point in getting upset about them getting past me when I got that slow down Much better lap than previous. One minute fifty one point two one nine. Ooh, a little bit of oversteer. Bit of understeer.
guy behind me is catching me pretty quick. Uh, I think he might have been someone who had a bit of trouble early on. Three, about now. I'm taking that way too cautiously now, losing way too much time in there, but after messing it up twice, it's a bit of a reset. Slow down to how you can make it and then slowly build up again if you feel confident enough, I guess. Minute 52.593 You've got a slow car on the left, car dropped ahead. A lot of smoke out around here. You've got a slow car on the right. I think they might have had a bit of a coming together, those two. I'm going in step here, put in the more. I didn't understand what he said then. So car number 6 and number 13 come into this corner. Number 13 just loses it on the corner. And uh, number 6 hits him really, really hard. Um, both cars spin out. Um, but number 13 decides to call it a day. I think he had some, some wheel damage, I think. Number 6 had quite a lot of front-end damage from that as well and that's really going to cause him some trouble down the straights. Right, don't get distracted by the car in front, still make the chicane. Three, before the two. Wow, he broke even more than I did. Can't see any damage on him, but he may have some front end damage. Definitely seems slow. A car on your left. Clear. One minute fifty one point three eight one. You're in fourth position. Four. Oh dear. Just staying still. There we go. Safe to re enter. So, it might turn to spin here at turn one. Um, I think I was just carrying a bit too much speed. I was in the wrong gear. I was actually in fourth, and it should have been in third. Um, when the spotter told me I was in. I was in fourth place, I got a bit overexcited I think. Um, just tried to hold my position, stay predictable, let people go past me and was able to carry on with, uh, with no damage. Oh dear, I got up to fourth place, that's ridiculous. Slow down, oh, just let the correct gear. Calm down a bit, got far too excited about being in fourth I think. Still no damage. Bit of pride. Stopped 
That was a bit scary, some headlights coming towards you. It's quite a moment for car number 6 and 17. Obviously number 6 is a little slow um, with his front end damage. 17 went to go around the outside. Uh, I don't think 6 noticed and just took his normal line um, and caused a massive crash. Um, I think that was the last we saw of car number 6 um, in this race. More smoke. And I'm up to sixth, goodness me. There's been some people making mistakes in this race. I am one of them. Is that the black car that might have some front end damage? I don't think I'm catching him fast enough for it to be him actually. Three before the two. So, starting lap at 11. One minute fifty two point three seven one. mess up just before the straight, do you? God. You got about five laps of fuel. I hope I've timed that right. We're on lap 11, 5 laps of fuel. I think we're only going to do 14 laps. Hit limit again.
So sixth place so it's, it's actually going better than I expected if I'm honest with you. Don't forget the chicane. Three, four, two. So one spin and missed the chicane twice. Oh, and, and hit a car. Apart from that, uneventful. One minute fifty one point nine nine four. Slow car ahead, car stopped ahead. Yeah, don't worry, mate, we've all done it. Car number nine's turn just to uh, have a spin in turn one. Very similar, I think, to uh, a lot of the spins. Um, carrying too much speed in, too much gas out, something like that, and uh, a little spin. Um, again, he got going without causing uh, any delay to anybody else, and, uh, and on we go with the race. That's one more spot made up for fifth place now. For Is there another spin left in me? Probably. Thank you. Caught this blue car very quickly. What's going on with that? He must have had a moment as well. Too far ahead for me to have seen, but this car number 16, the uh, Louis kind of car, um, just messed up that corner and had a big uh, collision with the tyre wall causing some pretty major damage to the right hand side of his car causing him to be incredibly slow in uh, in the fast bits of of the, of the lap three two oh went down the third for some reason then Don't think I'm going to be near enough him for the first corner. One minute fifty one point six eight three. You're back in fifth. Good job. Patience. Might even sit behind him. You got about two laps of fuel. Try and get a good exit. Oh, I missed the thing.
Sorry, mate. Clear. 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 I think that was the end. Alright, there's the checkered flag. Great job, you did really well. So the top two just pretty much ran away with it, but uh, fourth place was fantastic. I'm incredibly happy with fourth place position. Uh, it gave me 56 championship points, which I'm happy with. Um, eight incident points wasn't so good. Um, that lost me 0.1, uh, sorry, uh, 0 0.1 of my safety rating, but I managed to increase my I rating by 49. Um, fourth place, I'd have absolutely bit your, your arm off for that. So, at the start of the race I didn't expect to do quite so well. It was um, split two of two, but um, still um, I actually did a lot better than I expected to in that race. So tough race at that track. Um, next week is at Summit Point Raceway, which is a, ra a race track that everyone who has iRacing has got. So hopefully I will take part in that one. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please consider giving me a like. If you want to please leave a comment to say uh, what you enjoyed about the video or uh, what I could be doing better. If you want to see the next race in this series click on the text next race in this series and if I've done the next race and uploaded it then the uh, that link will take you directly to that race. If you want to see the first race and corresponding races from the series please click on the corresponding icon. If you can't wait that long then click on one of the other icons and it'll take you to the series of those races playing the first video at the start. Feel free to follow me on Twitter or Twitch with the Jarrett UK handle and, uh, and I'll see you at the next race. Thanks for watching.